Hey, welcome back to some Ark Valgaro. We're over here at the base today. We're, uh, we're gonna be expanding a little bit. So I have two different projects I'm gonna be working on. Uh, I started getting some irrigation ran. I, I really hate it because there's no, like, nice way to make this look, but I'm going to, uh, gonna be putting up an industrial cooker. So I, I really don't like them because you have to run irrigation, but man, just using those cooking pots was just a pain. So I got some pillars set up for the foundation. And uh, I don't know if I'd be able to run the pipes all the way to the top to the greenhouse so I can irrigate that too. But I made a couple more beer barrels. So I'm going to have the industrial cooker down here and the beer barrels. And then back here, we're going to go ahead and just build, I think right here, we'll make a, a flat platform. I'm going to build an area. Dude, back off. Don't go on my base. No stick goes allowed. But I'm going to be building an area for the, uh, the fairies. I, I started getting a couple of those hatched up. Uh, I'm not sure how many I'm going to take into the beta boss battle. But I'm looking at probably 10 or 15 of them. The stats are turning out pretty well. This is one of my, my recent ones. It's hard to get 100% imprint. I've only got 80% on two of them so far. But the... Uh, Health is pretty good, and uh, the damage, man, they're coming out at 500. So I'm real happy with that. So, let's go ahead and start getting the ceilings placed down. Oh, man, it's not going to be level. I wonder, I wonder if stairs will connect it. I don't know if it'll snap to that and go down or not. Oh yeah, oh yeah, we're good, we're good, we're good. I didn't think about that when I started putting the pillars out. I think I'm only going to go too wide on this, because I don't want to go too wide, you know what I mean? Hopefully I can get the, the irrigation to connect. It's been, I think I've only ever built one other industrial cooker, so I think you need to put it down on, uh, where is it? I think I'm going to need one of those as well. Um, maybe put it in the corner there. Oh, yeah, that's going to be nice. Is that... Do we want it here? Ah, there's enough room for a railing. Yeah, I want to put a railing on the back. Awesome. Okay, so that's going to work. So, let's see if we can connect them with the, the flex. Uh... Is that connect in there? I can't see. That's gonna work. Wait, go back. Dude, quit moving around so much. I don't know if it's trying to connect through where the pillar's at. That's what I'm... There we go. That'll work. Cool. So that's irrigated. I wonder if it is up top. Hopefully. Should be. Oh, yeah. We're good. Awesome. Okay, so that's good. So... Let me take a look. Maybe I should put down... Let's see if I have any first. I got four. I want to get these down before I put my barrels down. What do I need? One, two, three, four more? I wonder if I can put some more stairs there. Now yeah, we'll try it. Let's take a little bit of this. A little bit of that. So first thing is some stairs. And then railing. Oh, that'd be awesome if this works out. Nah, I don't think it wants to snap to it because it's right next to... Dang, man, that would have been nice. It should. But it won't. Oh, well. That's alright. That's, that's enough area there to get through. We're not going to be over here that much.
Yeah. Nice. Okay, let me grab the beer barrels. And we'll put those out. See, I won't need the stairs. I don't think I'll need pillars. Or the ceilings. Get rid of all this stuff so I'm not overweight. And then I just got to figure out getting these things irrigated. Want them here? Or do we want them against the wall? Eh, maybe against the wall. Uh, yeah, mm, I don't know. Let's just try it like this. Oh, we can move that a little bit closer. Nice. I can't remember on irrigating these. I just need the pipes or if I need to use the So do three verticals. And I'm hoping I can use the um, the flex one. I'm trying to do this without making it look all funky, you know? Nope. Oh, man. Dude, let me up. All right, so that's not going to work. Oh, maybe it's because I wasn't close enough. Nice, right, there's one. Can we connect the others? Oh, we can. Nice. Still a little glitchy, though. Well, I don't want you to connect to that one. I just wanted to... There we go. Alright. It's... It's alright. And this last one... We need to connect down here. Maybe I can do a vertical. Or an incline. I don't know. We'll try both. I think that's going to be too far. But I might be able to connect those. Dude, if this works, I'll be so happy. Oh, it's gonna... Nice! Awesome, man. Irrigated. All three. Cool. So now I just need to, uh, wow, not pay attention this way by looking at them. <laughs> it's, oh, man, it's like a little, little, little bit crooked. Uh, I think I have enough berries to fill those up. I can just take the ones out of the ones that are here. Because, man, it's such a chore to keep running back up and down from here. I need to empty the beer out of here before I destroy them. I think I have enough. I'm wanting to tame one of those little uh, poo flingers. Okay, I don't know how you pronounce them. But uh, you got to sneak up and feed them a beer before they knock you out. One, two, three. One, two. Three. One, two, three. Awesome. Nice. Okay, so now beer production will be a lot easier. Uh, all I need to finish here is. Do I want to wall that in? I kind of like the kind of like the pillar look. I mean, other than the 
the jacked up irrigation pipe underneath. I think we'll just leave it like that. Put our banner back out. Yeah. I'll have to fix that later. When I have time, I'll, I'll straighten that up because it's going to bug the hell out of me. Alright, so task number one is complete. The uh, the other thing is getting the, the platform. We're going to have to take one of these back there because I don't know how big I'm going to need. So what I'm wanting to do is, is build it so that I can have, it's going to be kind of like a, a stop sign shape. That way I can have all these guys uh, nose to nose and put the, uh, the Lystro in the middle of them. And it'll boost everything. So we'll take this one for, for reference. Alright, so let me go grab some foundations. Foundations or pillars? I think we're going to do pillars because that's some uneven terrain. Alright, I'm going to make up a bunch of pillars and... Oh, you know what? That's not going to work with pillars. Because there's no triangle ceiling, is there? Let's take a look. I don't think there's any flat triangle ceiling. Oh, man, there's not just a foundation hmm that's gonna mess up the whole way I was wanting to do it well maybe we'll do foundations and I'll just have to uh, pick a flatter area I don't know man they're not that big I might be able to just do it all right here all right anyways I'm gonna get some foundations and stuff made up and then uh, we'll come back maybe I'll make some pillars and ceilings just in case we'll see you back in a few all right, so I changed the plan a little bit. So instead of doing it for the Therese, uh, the the Alpha boss I'm going to be using Spinos for. So we might as well just build a platform big enough for Spinos. So this is kind of what I got laid out for an outline. Is I put uh, ceilings, of course, on all those, and I have some steps down here. But man, this thing's going to be massive. I didn't think it was going to be that big for that many Spinos. If I do. Do what I was talking about and put it to where the Lystra will be kind of in the middle. It'll, uh... Let me get him kind of situated where he's at an angle. That way I can see how many pillars wide I'm going to be. So that should be good enough. Right about there, right? Be able to put one in the middle. Kind of like a reference point. Where's your nose at, dude? Stop looking at me! <laughs> dude. Alright. And then, we'll come from this way and do the same thing. I can kind of see how many... Or actually, I can just... Use this as a reference. So I guess this is about halfway, right? Maybe a little bit more. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So we need to be 16 wide. All right, so that should be halfway. And one, two, three, four. Man, it ain't gonna work like that. I might have to go out the other way one more. I got some ceilings. I had to bring the uh, RG out as a temporary storage. Yeah, I can come one more this way. So that should be enough there. So that's 15, and then one more will hang over, which will make 16. So that'll work. Wow, that's, that's barely enough. But it is enough, so... Let's so, grab some of these, and we'll just double, double check, make sure it'll be fine down here at the end. Because it does get kind of narrower a little bit. Oh yeah, it's gonna be fine. Uh, uh, yeah. It's gonna be fine. Let's finally go ahead and get rid of these from our first days here.
And then that should be... I don't think this is going to cause a problem down here. Maybe it will. We'll have to see. I might have to adjust it a little bit. Or it doesn't really matter if this clips into the ground. It'll still level it off. Well, I'm going to go ahead and start the task of laying all of these pillars out. And getting the ceiling done. And I was wanting to do some kind of little roof over it. Not a, not a closed in like that. But just like some some pillars and just like a some type of little roof just to make it look different we'll see i'm gonna go ahead and start on this though and uh should be daylight whenever we come back so yep gonna jump on it all right well let's show you what we have i couldn't build it as wide as i thought because it was uh it was getting too close into the ground and clipping over here and i wasn't able to put enough foundation so instead of doing the 16 by 16 we ended up with a 13 by 13 which is still i think fine I, uh, I just pulled one of the spinos up to see, and if you do, do four, and then, you know, four and across, and then three in each of the corners, which I think would, should fit alright, we should be able to get, what, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirty, forty, we should be able to get sixteen, which I think I'm only going to be taking fifteen in, so we'll do sixteen, and then I'm going to take a couple pigs and stuff like that, so I think this will be just, just fine. I went ahead and it's this, uh, an odd number. I went ahead and put three sets of stairs. So I got some here and then uh, on the other two sides as well. So that way we can get up and down with everything without having to cause too much of a problem. I didn't put any stairs on that side just because, well, there's no way to go. <laughs> so that's uh, that might just be railed off. I'll probably rail off in between here too. I'm not exactly sure what I want to do for a ceiling, if anything. Um, I just, I don't know. This was, uh, a lot more stone than I thought. I cleaned out all of my stone, and man, the, the dodic is been working overtime. <laughs> but, I'm gonna see, uh, see if I can find some water. I'm gonna see what else I can come up with, and try to get something, something on the roof here. I'm not sure what yet. Go ahead and get my railings up, and I don't know if I want to put spotlights. I'll probably just put torches. Torches out here, and then I'm going to build a little access panel. I, I want it all off now, but I'm going to build an access panel there and put uh, in the middle a feed trough. That way, all of them be able to. That way, all of them will be able to eat off of that one trough. Makes stuff a lot easier. But, anyways, I'm going to get back at it and see if I can get this thing finished in the next three or four hours. Well, the arena is now complete. So this is what I came up with. You can barely fit under it with the Spino. And then hop off without having to worry about getting stuck. Went ahead and did the uh, the middle parts with just wood, just to make it look a little bit different. Not have everything the same. And then I have some wood ceilings, along with, uh, I used wooden stairs to connect them. And then a little bit of glass up there, so it's still like a sunroof, but you know, don't want the guys getting rained on when it actually rains. So I'll go ahead and fly up real quick and show you what we have. This thing was a pain in the butt to get started, but, um, almost fell off right there. So yeah, nothing to do the corners in, but it still looks fine. And then, uh, kind of like how the stairs look. But once you, uh, once you get it start, finally get it started, it's not too bad to keep on. It's just that, uh, that initial getting everything down so you can get it placed. And then... I got the uh, the torches I ended up with. They have the place lit up, and then under here is where I can put my uh, put my food. So when you show a visible area, it'll show you that it's just big enough to cover the whole area. So that'll feed all them. And like I said, I'll do the uh, I'll do the theories first, and then I'll do the spinos after. It's like a a dual purpose building. A little bit of water while we're there. So that's what I came up with. I think it's not too bad. It'll hopefully keep the uh, keep the Brontos away too, man. Those things are so annoying. They keep coming up, and I had one tear up kind of my part of my building earlier. It didn't destroy it fully, but I had to repair it. Yeah, so that's it. Uh, I think it's pretty good. It'll work out. But we're going to go ahead and leave this one here. And uh, as always, thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.